name is Tutu Malaku. I'm uh, the founder of Tutu Ethiopian Table and I have restaurant trading but today my first YouTube uh, video I'm going to record to show you how to cook veg or meat um, stir fries and using Tutu's sauce here it is so now available also on the um, online is at tutustable.com website so now start chopping first i'm going to chop my paper so as you see i have one chopping board here for the veggie and also another one for the meat dish here yeah? so what you do you shred it all your vegetables you don't need to really chop them fine just shred it so easy to fry so i want to slide with them So I use three papers, like green, red and orange one, for both dishes. And you use uh, 400 gram of uh, chicken for the meat, and also 450 gram um, mushroom, and uh, some couple of uh, red onions. And next I'm going to do mushroom. The mushroom, like I said, you need 450 gram mushroom. Okay. Onions. So onions also have to be shredded. You don't need to really chop them fine. Now I'm going to chop chicken. The chicken is here. Different uh, chopping board. So need to mix up the meat with the veggie. So I will say tablespoon for the frying. But depends how oily you like your food to be. Okay. So one thing I have to show to you is I think everybody should have one in the house. You might you might wonder. This is like a minced garlic. Normally what I do when I prepare my garlic, because I don't have time to chop every day. What I do, I buy fresh garlic, I put them in the cold water and you keep them overnight. The next morning you peel them and you mince them. So every time you keep them in the freezer. So when you cook, you just take them out, maybe three, two minutes before. So the time you finish cooking, they're going to be ready to be scooped up. So I think that's a really good idea to have it in your house. So the chicken is going to be on the smaller saucepan. And uh, that's the vegetables frying. So. Here. so I think the red onion is good for frying, you know, when you fry stuff because it gives it that really nice flavor. That's why you might, you might wonder why I put so much uh, onion. Like I said, you don't need too much ingredients to make a really nice uh, food. So you, as long as you use the right combination. Okay. And that's for my chicken one. So what I have a trick to fry the onions quickly. You know what if I use? If you put salt, it helps it to cook quickly. So the salt, it's up to you how much you want to put. Because uh, some people like salty food, some people they don't, so... And the oil, look, the uh, smell is so nice.
uh, once uh, cooked, you might wonder how we're going to have this. So, to be honest, you can have it with pita bread, or rice, or couscous, or some wrap. So you just do what really you fancy. As long as you have the base, you know, so easy. And so once, you, if you have any left over, you know, you can keep them in the fridge for two days. With the, you know, as long as you seal them properly, they're okay to be, you know, kept in the fridge for, I would say, two, three days. So you cook them nicely, so they can stay longer. So now I'm going to put my peppers for the chicken. And then more pepper for the mushroom. So uh, like if you don't put the garlic, normally I put garlic before I finish cooking because the flavor can stay still there. So once this one is cooked maybe three, four minutes, I will put uh, my hot sauce and garlic. For the chicken, depends how you like it. Me, because I like a bit hot my food, I'm going to put two spoons of my hot sauce. One, two, and so garlic, one teaspoon of each, voila. So now what you do, you just mix them in the middle, together with the garlic, and this in here, so now you mix them together, wow it smells, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. Wow, so nice. So you mix them nice there one. Just maybe two minutes once you put that and after that you're done. And chicken. Wow, so amazing smell. Even sometimes really I just, uh, you know, I just wonder when I use my own sauces. I don't know how good it is, which when I smell it, I say, wow, looks like I'm using someone's sauce. But I said, actually, this is my sauce. <laughs> wow. So, nice. so you can have a brown pita bread that, uh, I have only white one today for the house, so what I do, I'm going to serve. Wow, so nice. More chicken. So, who's going to have a taste now? Do you want some cutlery? Wow, I can't eat this all day. You yeah, know? it's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> My goodness me. It's so Moorish. Just like simple ingredients, you know, you have like three, four ingredients in one dish and to deliver this. It's amazing. I think mm. just the sauce, just plain on the... Yeah, the sauce is mm. nice and extra dimension, mm. taste. Mm -hmm. With the vegetables as well, it's nice and healthy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 